All right. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, all across the globe, welcome to another edition of Power Connections with Dr. Warren Crabb. Doc, it's been a minute, man. How you doing, sir? Good to see you today. <laughs> well, let, let me say, first of all, yeah. uh, good grand rising, King. Ooh, you know, yeah. I've been waiting on this day. Yes, sir. Oh, my God. I have never, ever, ever, ever experienced this day before. Matter of fact, it never even existed before. Exactly. Uh, this is the first time that this day existed, and it will never exist again. Right. I'm so excited about today. Yeah, that's powerful. Thank you so much. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you're excited as we are as well. And we're just thanking God for another opportunity to be here. Uh, we have limbs that are moving today. We have our eyesight. We have our taste buds and uh, all of the above. Matter of fact, I remember Dr. Crabb was talking about brushing our teeth. We even brush our teeth with no assistance, you know, and the tongue. <laughs> I love it. And those lips. That's right. Those and those lips. Amen. I love it. That's wonderful. <laughs> hey, ladies and gentlemen, we've been uh, chatting with Doc throughout the year, but it's been a minute because of our, our wonderful, wonderful scheduling. But uh, Doc is growing. That's what I got excited about. Dr. Crab's network is growing, folks, and that's what I get excited about. So, Doc, uh, we want to give you that time right now because we are on a specific assignment from God. So, Man, yes. tell us where you've been, what's going on, Dr. Crabb. Welcome to Power Connections, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much, Doc. Okay. Now, uh, first of all, I can't uh, take any credit for anything. Woo! Okay. Uh, the creator of the heavens and the earth is in charge, and I'm just yeah. an obedient. Come on, servant. man. There you go. Okay. Oh, uh, man. It's just that simple. I promise yeah. you that yeah. I've never done the things that's going on in my life. I've never done it to this extent before. Neither have I, buddy. Okay. Yeah. Uh, for those of you who are not aware who I am, I'm Dr. Warren Crabb. I am the founder and president of Transcontinental Society Unlimited Productions. Now, when I say unlimited productions, that's exactly what I mean. Yeah. Uh, our, our campaign right now is Ex-Cons Living in the World Today and the movement Ex-Cons Matter. Yeah. Uh, we've raised the awareness of, you You can see on the screen right there, of the psychology mm -hmm. of a successful return. Mm -hmm. Now, this is not only for people who are returning from incarceration. This right. is people who are returning from any instances in their lives that they have to bounce back from. Yeah, yeah, Doc. Okay, there is the death of a loved one, a divorce, the loss of a child, uh, uh, you know, I'm not saying by death, You can, people lose children, you know, every day, you yeah. know, it's, it's still going on in the world, you know, and, uh, and these children are not dead, you know, that's I, awful for a parent, yeah. you know, to lose a child and, and, and yeah. you know, yeah. I mean, it's just some things going on in the world that yeah. we have to stay aware of. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. The psychology of bouncing back from them, those things is not really not taught in any schools. My curriculum is the only curriculum on earth mm. that comes from a different standpoint of the psychology of a successful return from something. Yeah, yeah Doc. You're not going to learn those things in any colleges, any schools. You're going to you're going to be familiar with the, yeah. the process and the curriculum. Right. You know, but it's a different viewpoint of what's been going on since the dawn of time. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We've been very, 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 very busy at TCSUP, I'm glad to say. Mm -hmm. um, some years ago, a brother named Cuba Gooden Jr., uh, the actor, uh, yeah. made a movie yes, sir. called uh, Life of a King. And the movie was about a brother who had uh, bounced back Mm -hmm. from incarceration after doing 18 years. Yes, sir. And he got out of prison and uh, mm. he, he uh, uh, got a job as a janitor in the school. And one day the, the principal asked him to, you know, watch the uh, the ones that had to stay over, you know, for punishment yeah. and stuff. A little yeah. bad children. Yes, sir. Uh, detention. Mm. And uh, he did that, and then they found out he was an ex-convict, and they had to let him go. He couldn't work in the schools anymore. But by then, he had started teaching them chess. Wow. Wow. And he wound up opening a chess house. Yeah. In Washington, D.C. You know, uh, uh, for the youth to yeah. come and play. And they wound up competing 
internationally. Hmm. You know, and I'm proud to say that this um, this brother here, uh, his name is Eugene Brown. Hmm. Cuban Good Jr. portrayed him in the movie. Oh, wow. Uh, uh, him and I are starting the uh, Transcontinental Society Unlimited Productions World Tour motiva Motivation Speaking. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, we are going to be touring. We're going to be speaking. Uh, we're going to be uh, speaking to the youth. We're going to be speaking at colleges. We're going to yeah. be speaking at schools. Uh, we're going to be speaking in auditoriums. Uh, we are going to do some things together. And I'm proud to be associated with this brother yeah. and uh, yeah. him taking me on as wow. a mentor. Wow. wow. You know, uh, uh, he, I, I love my mentors. You're one of my mentors. My mentors are awesome. Uh, Reverend Al Duncan is a mentor of mine. Yeah. Uh, 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 Zandra Evans is a mentor of mine. Yeah. Uh, uh, I, somebody once told me, say, if you want to be wealthy, you got to get a wealthy mentor. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Back in the day, I knew if you want to be a millionaire, you got to hang out with millionaires. You got to think like they think. You got to act like they act, walk like they walk, talk like they talk, learn what they learned. Yep. Yep. If you want to be like them. Yep. You know? Yep. And, yep. and that was the beginning of me on my trail of becoming the first African American trillionaire. You know, now today I have manifested that I am a trillionaire here. Sure. I mean, I have those multiple zeros in my bank account as of yet. Yep. But you best believe if it's God's will, because this is his mission. That's right. It's coming. It's not mine. That's right. That's right, Doc. You know, I'm just being an obedient servant. Yeah. Doing what I'm told. I gave up my will. I, I, when I say I gave up my will, how many years you've been telling me, you've been hearing me say this, and you've been watching my life. Since we met. Since we not met. only uh, you know, at that time, I was just on the podcast on YouTube and, and Facebook. You know, now I, I'm international. You know, yeah. I, I'm on Roku. Yeah. You know, I, I'm uh, the streaming services on television now. Do so. I'm on right. the radio, on the That's FM right. band. That's I right. own four radio stations out the Crab Network. Yeah. Radio Network. Yep. You know, all these things I wrote about while That's I was powerful. in prison. That is doing powerful. Two and a half years. That's powerful. It's on paper. Powerful. All powerful. these things, I'm, God gave it to me and he told me to write it out. And I wrote a half a billion dollar a plan. Wow. And this is one of the programs I'm so excited about, the Motivational uh, Speaking Tour uh, for Transcontinental Society Unlimited Productions. Wow. The first event that we're going to be having is going to be coming up very soon in the month of September. Uh, we're going to be having the uh, uh, the second annual mm -hmm. conference declaring a state of emergency. Yes, sir. Our last conference, uh, that's that right there is the flyer for it. Uh, uh, we had some awesome people uh, on the panel. Mm -hmm. You know, and, and, and these people are also uh, guests on the TV show. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All these people are prominent world changers. Yeah. You know, and and, 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 and they mess with the old ex kind here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they think the ain't sky here, you know, mm -hmm. because my life is an open book. If you look, mm -hmm. just Google me. My life is an open book. My my hours are filled mm -hmm. with responsibility. Yes, sir, it is. And I gladly take on that responsibility. I don't complain because I asked for this. Laying yeah. on a cot, a steel yeah. cot, with a one-inch mattress. That's amazing right there. Eight and a half years with calluses on my side. I prayed for this. Yeah. And because I was obedient, this is what God gave me, but he gave it to me to represent him. Yeah. It ain't about pinning pins and laws on my chest. Right. The creator of the heavens and the earth is in charge. Yeah, there you go. It's a new God. day. It's a new day. Yep. America has already fallen. It's time for America to pull itself up by their bootstraps and yeah. become one nation. Yep. Guess who's running for president in 2028? 
<laughs> you better, they better, man, listen. I don't know what God got in store for me, but that's been in the back of my mind. Yep. Retiring yep. this year and preparing yep. to be president in 2028. Yep. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just a humble servant. Wow. wow. I don't know nothing about politics, but I know about people and I know about souls. Amen. Amen. I know what it is to suffer and I know what it is to have success. Mm -hmm. I know what it is to dumpster dive and I know what it is to ride the back of a limousine. Mm -hmm. I know what it is to be homeless and I know what it is to live in a palace. Mm -hmm. I'm a human being who pee, poop, live and die. Yeah, yeah. Just like everybody else. Yeah, doc. That's what we all got in common. Yep. Every I don't care what language you speak, what you look like, what color you think you are, uh, right. that they're declaring that you are. Uh, I don't care uh, if you like me or don't like me. Uh, we all people live and die. That's right. That's the same blood. Period. Yep. And if we don't get this planet together for our children and our children's children, and our, it's a generational curse that has to be broken. Yeah. And I'm on a mission. Yeah. I'm on a mission for the good of humanity. Yeah. I'm Dr. Warren Crabb, and I approve this message. Amen. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for joining us today. This is Power Connections with Dr. Warren Crabb. Guys, right there, there's a website to start the process right there, guys. He mentioned a lot of great things he's doing. There's a website, thedoctorproject.com. I want you guys to go to that, guys, after you finish this broadcast today. But also, too, guys, I want you to share it out as well. Because Doc got some powerful things going on, ladies and gentlemen. Not only is he a businessman, ladies and gentlemen, he's also a minister of the gospel as well, ladies and gentlemen. He's also an awesome, awesome speaker, guys. And I want to, Doc, I want to let people know if you've got a media network of any type, you need to invite Doc to come on out on your broadcast, whether it's live in the immediate area or if it's virtual, guys. So if you have a, a television network, a radio network, podcast, streaming, you, even if you got now, even with uh, what's it, uh, TikTok now, I can give you an hour uh, on the network. So you, you TikTok and now you can bring them on your TikTok shit channel and talk for a few seconds or a few minutes as well. So guys, they went from 10 minutes to an hour now. You can download your uh, videos. Isn't that powerful? So guys, you're gonna wow. see on TikTok later on as well. So thank you so much for that. But guys, I want you to go to the drproject.com, the drproject.com. Hey, lastly, guys, I wanted to mention that one thing that Doc mentioned that he did years ago, he wrote down the vision that God has given him. He wrote it down. Now, I'm sure he remembered it in his head, but he also wrote it down. Guys, you gotta write your vision down. So therefore it could come to pass. Now, keep in mind, it's not going to happen as soon as you write it down. Now, th some things may happen right then, but guess what? You're going to run to your vision that's on the paper, and that's the word of God. God, I love that part that you saw this earlier, man, where you was going to be and say God started putting, as soon as you did that, God started putting everything in place for you to get ready. Isn't that amazing? Even the people that had to be that in the- was 2009. I wrote that on paper. That 2009. Is amazing. Because I think about how God knows what he's doing. The people had to be born. They had to be in place where they were at at that time. Even, even back in 2009, people had to be where they're supposed to be so they could be where they're supposed to be today for you. That's amazing. I think I thank God for that because only he could do that. That's amazing. It ain't no one. Yeah, he so we can be who we want to be. It's amazing, Doc. Literally, Doc, the Lord really he arranged the whole planet just for you, man, just to get to where you at. No, he literally had to arrange the planet for you, the people, all the people, all the things that had to happen for you to get to where you, isn't that powerful? And, that, and he does it for other people the same way. You know, for their <laughs> that's powerful, man. Yeah, that's amazing. I can't even, you know, nobody, no scientists, I don't care who the smartest person on the planet is, they cannot calculate those odds of making it happen. God can do that for you, Dr. Crab, as he is, and then he can do it for me, he can do it for the whole planet simultaneously. Now, that's a God that you got to honor, folks. A God that can simultaneously give you your plan that he has given you. To, that's amazing. That just is amazing when you think about it. And uh, yes. without missing a beat, he don't make no mistakes when he does things like that. So, God, we just honor you just for who, being who you are, <laughs> just in that area, Whew, let alone all the other things that you do. 
uh, for us in the universe. Wow, that is incredible. Hey, Doc, last uh, thoughts. we got to give some final thoughts. A lot going on, as you know. Yeah. The Anything okay. to tell Let people? Let me get myself together because, you know, as you're talking, I'm feeling it. And yeah. I'm a crybaby, okay? I'm a 225-pound bald head black man who's a crybaby. That's all right. You I'm with know, you on that one. I'm with you. Oh, my God. God is great. Yeah, he is so awesome, man. Well, give us a quick action item there today, uh, Dr. Crab. Anything you want to tell the people out there that need yes. motivation, maybe a little motivation today? Yes, yes, absolutely. You 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 hit on you hit it on the head. Everything that we've been through yeah. made us who we are today yeah. so that we can become who yeah. we want to be. Yep. Yeah. Oh, and it's so intricate that the weave, the weave, weaving of yeah. the, uh, yeah. the 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 fabric right. of life is so intricate that only the supreme creator can uh, intentionally, intentionally, yeah, yeah we bow, make that. yeah, we bow, before. not by certain uh, happens or uh, you know by yeah. coincidence, coincidence, you know, coincidence or none of that stuff on purpose, right. Yeah. I am so glad to be here today on this planet, on this little ball of dust in the middle of all this vastness. Yeah, I love it, man. Thank it you. Glory. Amen. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, this has been Power Connections with Dr. Warren Crabb. Kevin Vaughn here with you today. We are excited about your future. We want you to write down your future right now and watch it come to pass, guys. Dr. Dr. Matter Warren fact. Crabb. Amen. That's powerful. Because he's living what he has put on paper. And he's living what God has put in his life. One thing I love about Dr. Crab, he knows he's on God's assignment, man. That's powerful. When you know you're on God's assignment and doing what he wants you to do, that will keep you going, keep your family going, and keep you blessed for the rest of your life, guys. Hey, guys, we want to leave you with this. As my mentors would say, Dr. Larry Carnes would say, hey, remember to always out love, out serve, and out forgive each other. And remember, there's nothing you can't do after you write it down. You make it happen, guys. Doc, thank you so much for your time today, man. Awesome. Awesome. Woo. I love it. Hey, guys, share this out on your platforms. we got to push this out because you never know who will be blessed by the words of Dr. Warren Crabb. Hey, this is uh, Elder Kevin Vaughn here, Kevin Vaughn and Dr. Crabb on Power Connections. We'll see you next time, guys. Have a great day, folks. Doc, have a great day. Hey, Young Kings, have a great day, my friend. <laughs> I love you. Amen. Amen. <laughs>